Listen to the following story. Unit 5 Aladdin and the Magical Lamp Aladdin was born in Arabia. He was the son of a widow, woman whose husband has died. One day, a stranger took him to a cave, hollow place in mountain, and told him to bring an old lamp from inside. He also offered Aladdin a silver coin for the work. Aladdin went inside, but was afraid and wanted to get out. The stranger, person not known, was a sorcerer, wicked magician. He blocked, stood in way of, the opening and ordered for the lamp. At that time, the sorcerer's ring fell off, got removed. Aladdin slipped the ring onto his finger. Suddenly, a genie appeared. I am the genie of the ring. He said, What is your wish? Something one wants. Aladdin replied, I want to go home. Lo and behold, he had gone home. Aladdin still held the old lamp in his hand. When he tried to clean it, a second genie appeared. I am the genie of the lamp. He said, What is your command? Order. Aladdin smiled shyly and said, Food, please. Lo and behold, it was done. From then on, Aladdin and his mother became rich and had a palace, jewels, food, servants. He married Halima, the Sultan's daughter. One day, the sorcerer came to the palace disguised, changed appearance as a peddler, person who sells something. Halima did not know that the old lamp was magical and gave it to him. Immediately, at that moment, the sorcerer ordered the genie to carry off the princess and the palace to a far-off land. When Aladdin found out that his wife had disappeared, not present there, he called the genie of the ring and said, Take me to my wife at once. Lo and behold, Aladdin was reunited, came together again with his wife. When the sorcerer was asleep, they took away the lamp. Aladdin rubbed the lamp. The genie was happy to be with his rightful owner. When Aladdin told the genie, let's go home, the palace rose.
lifted up or came up into the air and floated, moved like boat, dreamly back to the Sultan's kingdom.